Like all I've had is just the tip, right? I feel I already feel a bit jelly. Hey. Oh. Hi. Wow. Okay, we rank. Cakes, ice cream, pastries. Feels up. Yeah, I'm a cake kind of person actually. You need like texture. Um, I have a story about Chateaurice cake. Uh, I'm gonna say this on the internet and then my mother is gonna watch it and then she's gonna scold me. Okay. Because my arms are getting fatter and fatter. So the small strawberry princess cake from Chateaurice. I always buy one whole thing and eat by myself. <laughs> I don't even bother to use a knife to cut. I just eat with a spoon. Oh, your cake is like a regular small cake? The 20 cm one. Good I cannot remember. Maybe a couple of months ago, it's a tradition for some of my friends and I. After dinner, we'll go Chateaurice to buy ice cream and eat. I think I've only had their ice cream once. We have tried and ranked all the cakes from Chatterise. This time, we'll be trying and ranking every single pack of ice cream there is in Chatterise. Only ice cream cones, bars and popsicles have been selected for this video. And they've tried each and every one of them. Itadakimasu! Let's start from vanilla first. Okay. Um, I like vanilla ice cream with the black dots. Don't have. Don't have. It looks very milky though. It looks very ordinary. Oh, okay. It doesn't taste cheap, but it doesn't taste premium. I think they need to cancel the word premium. The vanilla taste is there. To me, it's quite strong, but there's no actually. See then. See law. Oh, it's not pink. That's a good sign. This smells like strawberry pokey. Oh my god, let me try. Not bad. Not bad. This mm. is okay. It could have been elevated a little bit more if there were more of the strawberry bits inside. Mm. Okay. I would I would put the strawberry one in B. B, not bad, right? A not so good matcha ice cream is when it's just sweet. Mm. Like that is the only thing to it. It needs to have bitterness. Must experience the full Cheers. flavor. Jisoo from Blackpink once said, Not bad but not good. The ice cream texture though is very smooth, but it just doesn't feel like it's real matcha. Yes. I would put that a C. Okay, I've never seen this before. Well, I should not have turned around and looked at the ingredients. Vegetable oil, even more yellowish than the previous one. Yeah. Well, this one is Wall's. <laughs> <laughs> it's really Wall's ice cream. Yeah. It's the it's artificial vanilla. Yeah. Yes. It tastes like the ice cream uncle's biscuit. Oh. It's not the ice cream uncle. It tastes like the ice cream uncle. Oh, the uncle. <laughs> <laughs> so cookies and cream is actually something that I always go for and I have very high expectations but uh, I do not have high expectations anymore. Wow. The initial taste is very weird. I can tell that it's cookies and cream, right? Because I can taste the bits of cookies. Mm. The ice cream itself, I don't know what is it. It's very strange. But it's on the same level as the vanilla one. This is an E. Agreed. Bubble tea! Well, the packaging says tapioca tea latte, so... Oh! Artificial, very, very sweet bubble tea. Mm, the pearl don't taste like pearl. Okay. I just don't like the taste. <laughs> At least you can tell that it's soft. It's very artificial and gelato. This is an E then. Yeah, this is an E. Yeah, Sugatake. Contracted farmer, freshly milk bar. The shape is like <laughs> sad. If you're the kind of person that hates the fresh milk taste, right, you're going to hate this. Okay, but at least like it lives up to its name because it's a milk bar. They never say vanilla ice cream. I guess if you're looking for a plain milk ice cream. Yeah, let's go and see. Wow, ah, what a boring ice cream. Don't say that. You go to Japan 7-Eleven, you buy the Starbucks latte. Then you open it, right? It smells like that. It's very milk coffee. Yeah. So like the coffee taste is not strong, but you can taste it. Lah. I think the coffee taste is stronger than other coffee ice cream I've had. No, my favourite. It's like if you have to put a coffee meter here, right? Out of five cups. It is four cups. I, I give it a C. C. Yeah, C. Again, contracted farmer, freshly strawberry milk bar. Mmm! Mmm! Mmm, strawberry. I like the strawberry bits inside. It's quite a nice light strawberry flavour. I think not bad compared to the rest. Oh my god, I can add another to my list. I can eat strawberries in the strawberry ice creams from Chaitarise. I will give this like a B. Same, same. Oh, I feel like I've tried this before and it wasn't as good. Mmm. Yeah, yeah. 
maybe you go eat tacho, right? Then they always give you the hot green tea, mm. right? Then they realise, oh my god, there's a lot of leftover. Let's make it into ice pops. This is it. Yes. It's very like water and green tea. But it has a very weird sweet taste. As an actual matcha lover and fan, mm. and this is not it. I'll give this like an E to be honest. Oh, I like this kind when it comes to red bean. Because it's like the potong one. Mmm! Wow, the red bean is real red oh, bean. It's better than potong, right? Because it's soft. No, I just tried the ice cream itself without the red bean. Okay, just taste the ice. Why put an A or B? B lah. Not my thing, but I'll give a B. Mango! Wow, wow. thick eh. You are supposed to bless it. <laughs> it smells so strong. Huh? Why is the texture like gummy? It's neither milky nor is it icy. 30 for you, 30%. Fruit. Oh. 30% fruit. Oh my god. Wow, it feels like like right, they're trying to mimic a mango. And it's quite sweet though. It's quite sweet, but doesn't overwhelm me. I would, I would give it like B. A B. B. Oh, I love peach. Da 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 da. -da. Also 30%. Okay. Mm. I don't like this peach taste. This is how peach tastes like? No. There's a bitter aftertaste. Mm. It's like they included the skin of the peach inside when they made this. Oh, ew. Okay. It's not something that I'll reach out for. It tastes kind of flat and weird. I'll give it a D. Pineapple. Ooh. Golden pine ice bar. Uh, I am in the fields of pineapple. This is a dull whipped ice cream I in tried. Disneyland. It was not bad. This smells refreshing. Like I close my eyes, I can see myself at Hawaii. There are bits of pineapple. This one really tastes like pineapple. It's really not bad to be honest. Yeah. Wow, is that an A or B? Mm. High B. High B. Got a different kind of peach, man. So it's a Yamana It's pink in colour, but the bottom is white. I don't know if it's just the bottom that's white or the inside is white. I don't know, try. Oh. <laughs> you like it? No, yeah, not bad. Wow, because it's a bit sour. I don't like Why? It's the perfume kind of peach. Mm. Oh, wait. No, no, no. Because you start from the bottom, which is the white part. I started from the top, which is only the pink part. The pink part itself is nice. But when you hit the white part, weird stuff really. Hi, why wow, the peach so disappointing? D. D? Yeah, I'll give it a D. Usually, I don't really like this kind of wafer kind of ice cream because the wafer is very, very soggy. Yeah. And it feels like you're eating styrofoam. But Ooh, it, it smells, smells good. Great. Yeah. Oh my god! Oh, it looks like a makeup palette. Can see the condensed milk. I just want to try. It looks a bit dirty. <gasps> it's real condensed milk. I believe it's fake one, man. Yeah, like maybe they make themselves kind. This then they put good. inside. Oh my god. Oh my god. Mm. Wow. This is nice. It's light enough for you to eat mm. at least half. And it's not boring. Yeah, and it's shareable. Mm -hmm. Good job, good job. S. Mm. Double fromage. I see some raspberry sauce. It's white, red and yellow. Hmm? Quite interesting, right? The flavour. Mm. Like, you'll be confused, right? What's with the aftertaste? Or oh, is the cheese? Is it? Is, is it, it a smelly? It's a bit smelly. Okay, this one tastes a bit like the uncle's raspberry ripple, but elevated. Wow, I feel not. It's not mm. elevated. Oh my god. This is very acquired taste. Wow. Yeah, you have to like the funk of um, the fromage, the cheese. Yeah. I do not, so I do not like um, this. It's not like they did it badly. It's just not my up to my personal preference. A or B? Maybe a B. Yeah. I'll, name it, I'll give it an A, mm. actually, for creativity. Oh, Opera cake. Oh! Oh my god, looks expensive already. It's a black color. It's black. Hey, you try it? Got alcohol. Ah. Is this tiramisu? Coffee, yeah. No, it's not tiramisu. Wow. The flavour is very rich. Eh? Very rich. It's like you're eating a cake inside the ice cream. This will be too gelat for me. Mm. If I have to eat the whole thing. Mm. The coffee taste is very, very strong. So if you are a coffee lover, I mm. think this will be great for you. They have things that look like cookie bits or biscuits. 250. This is... They can raise it up to 4 eh, to be yeah. honest. Either S or A. Same, same. Are you a sweet potato fan? Yes. I love sweet potato. Same. Ooh, why wow, you really looks like an oh, emoji. Cute. Eh. Okay, it just smells like wafer. It really tastes like sweet potato. But I think they added syrup to it. Mm. They make it even more sweet. Actually, maybe the sweet potato flavour comes from the paste. Super sweetness comes from the ice cream. Why must they make it so sweet? 
And I cannot imagine somebody finishing the whole thing, to be honest. I'll give this an E. Me too. Why the, the colour of this fish different from the previous fish? Yeah. The previous fish is yellowy. There's red bean paste with red bean and vanilla ice cream. Mm. Not as sweet, but still quite sweet because of the red bean. Mm. It's like a traditional kind of flavour with red bean and vanilla. Wow. This is quite boring actually. Actually, I'll, I don't find this as repulsive as this. I'll so, put it a D. Yeah, I'll put it as a D. Matcha. Please be bitter. Ooh. Ooh. Oh no, it has red bean inside. No, it's not. Eh. It's brown sugar syrup flavoured bean paste. Oh my god, it's gonna be very sweet. This is extra sweet. Oh. Ah! Well, the brown sugar is very extra. Yeah. I know the matcha is there. But the brown sugar just overwhelms it. I will give it like a D. Oh, that's Ooh. so smart! It was very nondescript like a cornetto. I'm a little excited because it's butter ice cream, not just vanilla or milk ice cream. It tastes like milk, that's all. I, mean, I know they're from the same sauce, but I don't taste butter. Because when you tell me butter, right, I think about the butter in my fridge that I add into my cooking. This, this is one, just... Yeah. This lacks the saltiness. And everything. Mm. I really hate melon flavoured <laughs> things. Uh, yeah, ice cream is ice cream. Why you have melon? It's so artificial, the smell. Oh, mm, I smell it. Oh. Wow. Not as bad as I thought it would be. I was waiting for the... Uh, uh. Actually, I think okay. It tastes very artificial. It's too sweet and too thick. I will put this a D or E also. Belgian chocolate. Look like a budget version of... What's the Takashimaya chocolate store? Glory... Glory or something. Yeah. Glory... It's really like a cornetto. La. Is this dark chocolate? Mm. Actually, not bad. There's a bit of bitterness to it. Mm. So, balance out a bit better. Mm. I'll give this a. Ooh, actually, B or C. Sir. I'll give this a B. Mm, okay. Kyoto Uji Matcha. Ooh. Wow. The, the cone is. Uh... Black. Ice cream is quite light. So, it feels like it'll be very milky matcha. Mm. Why taste like vegetable? <laughs> <laughs> it tastes like vegetable. The initial taste is very weird. Yeah. Okay, I can taste the bitterness that matcha is supposed to have. Yeah, the front part tastes like vegetable. Wow, this is bad eh. This is... Is it E uh, or F ah? E la, for me. It looks like a magnum wannabe. I can smell the nuts. Is it nuts? Hazelnut? What is the black things on the inside? Chocolate? It's the icy type of ice cream, which is my least favourite kind of ice cream. The chocolate shell actually shines more than the ice cream inside. It's only one bite, but it's super sweet. Yeah, it tastes very flat. I think I'll put this like a D or an E or something. I'll put it at E. Wow, the strawberry smell is extremely strong. Is this a... What is this? Uh? This is oh, the chocolate. kind of strawberry that you don't like, right? The yeah. artificial pink kind of yes. strawberry. It's cheap chocolate and cheap strawberry ice cream. Even more artificial than the kind that you eat as a child. It's like very sweet and a bit of sourness in it. In a bad way. Wow, goodbye. This is an F for me. This is an F for me also. Oh, it's just chocolate, chocolate, chocolate. She looks so unimpressive before she even eat this. Got a very weird after this. I know what is this made out of. It's made out of the chocolate coin. Yeah! Right! Yeah! That kind of chocolate. Oh my god. Go Maybe as there. a kid, you okay. But as no. an adult with developed taste buds, no. It's like something trying to be chocolate, but it's not chocolate at all. F. Your enthusiasm level very low. I can feel it radiating from you. Wow. For some reason, my, my first bite tasted like the wooden stick from the... <laughs> so I licked the wooden stick. It's not even on Wall's level in terms of vanilla ice cream. It's like frozen water. Mm, like frozen water is just ice lah. <laughs> the chocolate is also not nice. It, it's the same. The chocolate is just the same throughout because it's the same series. Okay, rating it uh, F. F. Baki tiramisu. Looks like vanilla ice cream with chocolate swirls. Yeah. But I can smell a bit of like some yeah. coffee or whatever. It smells like the coffee and the lady's fingers. Mm. Tastes like coffee. Mm. Actually, this one tastes a bit better than the rest of the Bakis. It has a bit of taste of coffee and it's not just sweet. I actually really like the coffee taste. Mm. But I think it can be a bit stronger. The chocolate works in this. Mm. Like it goes well with the ice cream. I think it's okay. I think yeah. it's okay. Ooh, this, this is cute! Why well, is from Hokkaido? Because I see the word Bei Hai Tao. It looks very ordinary. It looks like an ordinary white vanilla ice cream. Mm. 
Oh, oh, oh. If you are the kind of person that you love red bean in your dessert, right? I think you will really like this. Mm. Azuki. Mm. It's very like sticky and it's like a paste. It's not like the solid red bean inside. I'm a bit disappointed because the package said steam bun of milk ice cream, but there's no bun. It's just vanilla ice cream and red bean paste. I think I'll give this like a D. Ooh! It looks like my makeup sponge at home. Eee, I hope it's not this colour. Even at this distance, I can smell the chocolate. Mmm, it's chocolate ice cream. I feel like they have like a, a bitter spread that they spread on the inner layer of the shell. The outer layer touch your tongue first, which you're like, oh, okay, this is the normal dark chocolate. But as you eat, then it starts disintegrating. Then suddenly it's boom! Yeah. Bitterness. I think not for me. Not for me, but I would rank this an A. Oh, this is a really like giant super sized magnum. Um, I think this is quite a big boy. Mmm, vanilla! Not a fan of the vanilla. The chocolate also not that great. A little bit better than Magnum. I prefer Magnum. At least it's creamy, fake vanilla ice cream. Uh, I will give this a B. Oh, I like the little size. I'm hoping that the inside is not just vanilla ice cream. This smells like Play-Doh. A bit. <laughs> Why? A bit. Yeah. Huh? That's a crunch. Like, all I've had is just the tip, right? I feel I will give it a picture like. I expect some level of saltiness to a salted mm. caramel, but this is just caramel. Actually, the salted caramel taste does not come from the outer layer at all. The outer layer tastes like white chocolate. You asked me to eat the whole thing, cannot. So I'll give you a C. Ooh, it has the little bits outside. If you Photoshop the if you Photoshop the expensive three dollar ninety cents pokey, expand it. This is what it will look like. Mm. Mm. <gasps> The bits add a tart flavour, mm. which is a little bit sour, but not so much to overwhelm you. Overwhelms me in a very good way. Oh my god, it's like damn fun eh. Every time it pops in my mouth, it's like sourness, sourness, mm. sourness. One, two, three. S. S. You can smell the matcha, mm, right? Not bad, not bad. Still as good. Oh my god. Mm. Right? This is good. The outer layer is more bitter than the mm. ice cream itself. It's like a good bag. I don't know what is that crunch. I think it's cookies. Which add another layer of like texture. I love. But I think that if you are somebody who is not used to bitterness of matcha, I think you will find this a bit of putting. For real matcha lovers out there, this is good. S. S. I have never tried ramune before. Lucky not rambutan. Soda drink right in Japan, that has the marble in it, I think. It smells like medicine. No, it smells like bubble gum. Mm. I like. It's a little citrusy. Yeah, this is not something that's gelat because it's not creamy. Oh, there's little bits in it. There are like powdered white balls. Oh my god, that sounds bad. <laughs> Tastes like nothing. It's just powder. I'll give this like a B. Not my thing, but I can see that mm. people would like this. Mocktail Ice Pop Sprite Question. It says alcohol 0%, but then it says Chardonnay and lemon. Oh, Chardonnay is, is alcohol? Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Looks like sorbet. I think it would be nicer without the Chardonnay. Because it has the alcohol funk. It tastes like the lemon zest instead of the lemon. A bit bitter, then it got like the Chardonnay funk. Probably ice cream for adults. And it's a bit addictive. It's like I don't feel very happy eating it, right? But I can't stop also. It's called a toxic relationship. <laughs> I'll give it like mid tier, I'll give it like C. Oh yeah, I was gonna say C also. Yeah. Oh no. Oh my god, it looks like a giant tongue. Mm. Smells like a, one of those Glit air fresheners that I got smelled before. Like... <laughs> I also give this kind of face when I drink sangria, so I guess it's the same. Sour, tart, and it tastes like berries. A bit of like an alcohol taste. Also, the sangria one tastes sweeter. I'll give you a C actually. I might give this an A. <gasps> no la. Come on, come on, give me no. Huh? Seal is not going to like this. I just walked into an Aesop store. If you really look at it, you can see the stickiness. It's gonna feel very thick, I feel. <laughs> this one is really eating the Aesop. The... It really feels thick. Do you feel it? One fifth water, four fifth sugar. Mm. Okay, the more I eat it, the more I know what she's talking about. The cod liver oil, they got the orange taste one for children. It tastes like an orange vitamin. Yeah, D. Surprisingly, we found some good ice cream today. Yeah, I feel like it's not often we will have something for every rank. Yeah. But today, every letter got something. 
usually when I go to Chateraise, right, I only go and grab what I know. Mm. I want to look at other ice cream. I didn't know they have so many different kinds of ice cream. Mm. Also, it's so cheap. What the hell? Oh my god, please go and try all the strawberry stuff except for the Bucky range. And I think that the condensed milk one, it did live up to its name. Not bad. Mm, not bad, not bad. Surprising ones for me is the Opera. The ice cream inside has mm. a flavour and it has like crunchy bits so there's texture. My disappointment one, honestly, right, is the fish one. It's so sickly sweet. Maybe my memory of this kind of like fish ice cream like, is when I'm young and I can tolerate like the sweetness more but I feel like this is really off the charts. Thank you for watching this episode of We Try Everything. If you like this video, watch others over there. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye! Bye. And goodbye ice cream for the next one month. Oh, Toilet. 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 Wait, I need to fart again. <laughs>